This video details trapping mice inside of a basement. There will be pictures and videos of the mice after the fact, uh, so please, if you're not interested in that, click away from the video now. Here are all of the Amazon products that are used in the filming of this video, and the links will be in the description below. This old guy DIY video deals with how to monitor and exterminate mice in your house, garage, or barn. So back in the good old days, you know, you would just put out some rat traps, kill what you can, and move on. But with modern technology, for about 50 or 60 bucks, you can monitor and actually find out where these things are coming in so that you know, uh, you know, number one, killing them is important, but even more important than that, you have to figure out how they're getting in and block that so they can't keep coming in. So what we have here is a WISE cam. It's a, a Wi-Fi um, camcorder. And then we've just got an Amazon Basics tripod and I'll put all of the uh, information up on the, in the comments or in the description. And then we've got some of these little mouse traps. Uh, so I've got a buddy here who has a nice house on the river and noticed some rat droppings or mouse droppings. Uh, so what we did is took a bunch of these. I think you can get a 24 pack of them for like 30 or 40 bucks on Amazon. Just line them up through here. You put peanut butter in there. And then we've got the camera set up. So we've got one here. And then we've got another three of them over here just monitoring the entire basement. And you might notice that as I walk by, they follow me because they are actually motion tracking. Um, so they trigger based on motion or sound and then they will follow the target around. And then they're just plugged into the any wall socket here. Uh, so last night was the trial run. I don't know how many of these we set up, probably 10 or 12 traps. Uh, and we have at least two in here that we're going to recover. So here was the first little guy over in this corner. And uh, he was a pretty clean kill. We got the video on him. And uh, I haven't reviewed yet to see where he came from. I saw him climbing around this wall, so I think he came from the other side. And then over here, there's a creepy crawl space right here and uh, somewhere over here there should be a mouse carcass we'll see I actually don't know where that guy went which is might be an issue I could see on the video it wasn't a clean kill so I don't know where he dragged the trap off to and died so I mentioned we didn't get a clean kill on one of them it uh Luckily, it just grabbed his tail, so I don't think he's in any significant pain. Uh, but we do have a live one on this trap, and we will need to dispatch him. There you go. So this is the trap that we're using. It's a Tomcat. Let's see if you can see that. Tomcat snap trap. I bought 24 of these on Amazon for about 40 bucks. And then we're just baiting them with uh, creamy peanut butter and, uh, you know, use a knife. So where we actually put it, I don't know if we can see in here, um, but you load it from, you load it from the back. So you actually load it while it's not engaged. So there's no risk of getting your fingers in there or anything. Uh, this one actually looks like it might still have some in there, so I don't need to replace it. But we'll go over here which is where we caught that one. You just put it down, push it like that. Now it's ready to catch another one. So this is footage from the actual Wise Cam itself. They're motion detecting Wi-Fi cameras. Um, and they, once you put the SD card in, they'll record indefinitely. It's meant for a security system and it'll just keep recording over and over itself and it pays attention to motion and noise, and then it'll ping your phone if you set up notifications saying, hey, there was a, a motion event detected or there was a sound event detected. Um, in this case, you know, we can see this mouse running around here checking out a bunch of the different traps. Uh, he successfully navigates through a couple of them, maybe even got a couple bites of peanut butter, uh, but then eventually you'll see that he gets the last one, puts too much pressure on the trap, and it gets him. 
Uh, one thing to know about these is because they are motion detecting, uh, they'll kind of look around everywhere and you have to fine tune the sensitivity. You can pick how sensitive for it to look for motion and how sensitive to look for noise. Uh, I noticed that being in the basement, uh, if the noise sensitivity was too high, it would notice like footsteps or running water, things like that. Uh, and then motion, uh, you can it, it's so detailed that it can see a bug flying around and detect that motion and track it. Uh, you can set up something called a detection zone, which is lay, you, you lay out where you want the action to be captured. So in this case, for all of these, I've set up a detection zone right along the bottom of the wall where I expect them to be. And then you can view all this from your phone. Uh, it records to the camera. It also records to the app. Uh, and then you can see it. You can zoom in. You can look around. Uh, and then remotely, you can actually control where all of the um, cameras are looking. So in real time, you know, if you were out of town, you could use it and my intent is after we're done cleaning up all of these mice I can put these around the house you know we'll look for delivery guys they have two-way voice so you can speak to them uh, just after this I'll repurpose it as a general uh, security system and then for me personally a lot of the value in having these cameras especially for watching the mice is to learn about the, their behavior uh, you know if you weren't monitoring this you'd have no idea really how the mouse got into the trap or where it was coming from uh, but by reviewing the footage, I can see exactly where they're entering the house. I can see the paths that they take around. You know, if they're successfully avoiding traps, I can place them differently or do something different. Uh, it just offers a lot of insight um, and ability to fine tune your rodent control. So if you like this video or if it provides something helpful, you know, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one.